Hello, Wallace Mustangs. Welcome to another virtual art lesson. So, what I have in mind today is pretty cool, I think. I, I think it's fun. So, we're going to look at the Guggenheim website again. I showed you the Guggenheim Museum website a couple of days ago, and I want to, I want to go back there. So, I want to show you something. So, I'm going to share my screen. So, I thought it was cool that the Guggenheim website guggenheim.org slash artwork. So I'll probably go ahead and put this link in the resources so it'll take you right to it. I went to movements and it shows you all these different art movements throughout history, which is pretty cool. Some of them overlap and they kind of explain the style of artwork that was going on in that specific time period. So abstract expressionism was after World War II, post, you know, after 1945 to about, you know, and onward, really. Um, anyway, it tells you all about it. And as you scroll down, it lists all these artists that were participating, like Jackson Pollock. A lot of people know who he is, even though, or you've seen his work. Um, William de Koenig, people that I really, really love artistically, just because this is the kind of painting that I really like. So painting-wise, is what I, that's what I went to school for, was painting. And I love all these kinds of paintings. I mean, they're they look like just a bunch of colors, or they look like shapes, and they look like brush strokes. And I mean, that's exactly what it is. Um, Joan Mitchell is one of my favorite painters of all time. Um, Jackson Pollock, I'll, I'll click on this guy. You know, he did all those splatter paintings, or it was also known as action painting. This was a humongous painting, by the way. But, you know, it was 45 by 87 inches. So, I mean, that's a humongous painting. Anywho, hey, I wanted you guys to look at abstract expressionism because I think it's a very approachable time period in painting. Even if we look at the Koenig's painting right here, I mean, look at it, it's very simple. It's just colors and brush strokes. But look how expressive it is. What, what do you think, when I look at something like this, I always try to think like, what was the thought process or what was going on in this guy's head when he was making this artwork. Okay, so what I want you to do today is look at these artworks, just kind of scroll around, look at abstract expressionism and find something that you really like, you know, um, a shield Gorky, this is cool. Sometimes they're really weird paintings. I mean, they're not really paintings of anything. They're just lines and marks and shapes, but sometimes you can see some things in there might give you some ideas of what some of these things could be. Um, in any case, what I want you to do is look through this stuff and then after you find or look at some artwork that's abstract expressionism, I want you to go to the YouDoodle app again. We used it before and I will show you one more time. I gotta share my screen again. Um, I'm gonna get my phone going. I got the app on my phone. Now it's called the You Doodle app. And it is, you know, it's usually available for Android and iPhone. Um, let me get to it. The other day I showed you the Mandala app and I still have You Doodle on here. So here's the You Doodle app. No, I don't want anything. So no, I don't want to buy anything. It's gonna ask you to buy stuff. So anyway, I'm gonna pick my brush. It's cool because I was playing around with these patterns up here too. Um, so what I want you to do, I want you to make a piece of art on the You Doodle app that's kind of like abstract expressionism. So you know we had a lot of brush strokes, we had some shapes going on. Um, it doesn't have to be squares either. I'm just making some shapes. Um, so I'm making some abstract expressionism stuff. And I want you to think about, you know, having fun with it. You know, I mean, that's, that's all this is what this is about. Having fun, you know. Um, you know, that's what it's all about. It's just having a good time. Uh, try different things, you know. Uh, my pen, I try different stuff. Oh, my goodness, not this thing. Oh. Uh, don't want to buy so it's always going to try and get you to buy things um i don't know why i just want black i just want black ink is that okay no it's not allowing me 
whatever. I'm gonna use something else then. Um, any, anyway, I want you to try to make some abstract expressionism kind of stuff. And I mean, think about what you could do. And I mean, it doesn't have to be really anything crazy, but have fun with this app and think about abstract expressionism. You know, I showed you some artists that you can look at on the Guggenheim site, and this is called the You Doodle app. You Doodle. You Doodle. Okay. I showed you earlier. If you're not sure what to do, I, sh I, I went over this app in an earlier video. So just check it out and try to make some uh, abstract expressionism art. Okay. So give it a shot. It's fun. Um, pretty quick. And I mean, you can always make more than one thing too. So have a good day. Check it out. And I will see you.